what's going on guys, this is Sleeper Gating and I'm going to be bringing you guys a brief overview of the Beats Solo 2.0. Now the Beats Solo were meant to replace the Beats Solo 1.0 permanently as the new form factor and also the new model. As we can tell the form factor is very similar to the Beats Studio 2 which is because of the enhanced build quality along with the more metallic feel. Now here I've got the royal blue edition, the chrome version and I think it looks very nice and sleek as compared to the old one with bigger ear cups, thicker bass and just a better headphone experience altogether. Now noting some physical changes, the ear cups have gotten much thicker and softer which makes it much more comfortable to wear these headphones along with thicker metal clasps so this is much more durable than the original along with thicker headbands and also thicker ear cups in general which makes this a much more premium looking product. Now I got this in the US while it was on sale but the regular price is $200 if I am correct. Now that's currently leaving the Beat Solo 1 at a very cheap price point of $150 or lower so you can go check that out if you're interested and I'll be having all these links in the description below. As for the ports, all the ports are the same as there is one auxiliary port for the cable in the bottom left hand ear cup corner. In terms of sound quality, the Beat Solo 2.0 has a much heavier bass with a little less toned down highs which I think could have been approved on but overall this is much better than the Beat Solo 1.0 and I think it's a very great improvement. Anyways, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching this. Let me know what you think of this video or tips in the comment section below and as always if you want to see more videos of this, subscribe. Anyways, I'll see you in the next one.